Titans, and welcome back to Titan TV. I'm Chloe Crawl, and today I'm with the Innovations Dance Team with the captains and the director. I'm Mrs. Sampson. I'm Maddie. And I'm Sam. And we're just going to ask a couple questions just to get to know them. So Maddie, um, how long have you been doing dance for? Um, I did dance for a little bit when I was younger, and then I took a break for several years and was in gymnastics for eight years. But I recently got back into dance um, freshman year, which is 2020-2021. Okay. Um, what would you say is your most memorable experience when performing? I'd say so far it's probably my sophomore year of high school when dance team went to nationals. That was definitely an experience where all of us bonded so well and it was just a lot of fun Aww. and it was a great to experience that. That's so nice. Hello. And Sam, how long have you been dancing for? I've been dancing for 13 years. What's yeah. your favorite style? My favorite style is tap and hip hop. Okay. You like the vibe and like the... Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. And Maddie, since you've been doing dance for like so long, what would you say like your future goals are? Um, one of my main goals is definitely being like a backup dancer for a singer and okay. touring with them on concerts. I just like, you see these concerts of these big artists mm -hmm. and all these dancers are having so much fun with it. Plus they get to tour all over the place and if they're a background for their favorite artists, it just sounds really cool. That's definitely one of my biggest dreams. I've definitely like seen your dancing style and everything and I think that's like a really good like like yeah. path for you. Thank yeah. you. Of course. So Ms. Hampson, you've been dancing for a while, right? Mm -hmm. How long? I started dancing at 18 months old. Um, yeah, so oh my gosh. Little. I am not going to give you my age now, but <laughs> a very long time, probably 28 years. Oh, so, wow. Yeah. Okay, so you're pretty experienced. You, you have yeah. a lot. Okay. I graduated from the Joffrey Ballet School in New York City, so oh, I went wow. there to train. And <laughs> so, since you've been dancing for so many years, um, what have been like some challenges that you've faced, just your dancing world? Challenges I faced definitely the audition scene. Just making it as a dancer is so tough nowadays because everyone is good. Um, so at auditions, it's they're called cattle calls. There's about 300 to 400 to 500 dancers. They all look the same. Everyone's the same at these auditions and it's just hard to stand out so you have to have skills in order to stand out at those auditions. So it's like a lot of pressure. Yeah, like, a lot of yeah. pressure yeah. and you're just trying to do good and everyone's good so that's hard. I said so like 75 times. That's hard. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so for my captains, you guys have been dancing for quite a while. Mm -hmm. What would you say Miss Hampson has done for you guys and your dancing life? Miss um, Hampson has definitely supported us so much through these last few years. She's given us so many opportunities and I'm so happy that we get to dance with her. She's an amazing choreographer <laughs> and teacher. For me, because Miss Hampson has only been here for two years and I've been on team for three and I've been in dance elective for all four years of high school, I would say that the transition between the two coaches was a little bit difficult, but Ms. Hampson has definitely like helped us returning members get through it. And I just like appreciate that she has seen the potential in me to make me a captain after not having been on team all four years. But I just, she's helped me learn a but lot. But you were, yeah, you were able to show how much work you put into mm -hmm. this and how much time mm -hmm. and she yeah. sees that. And I think yeah. that's, well, that's, that's a great, yeah. yeah, such a great role model and it's good for you guys to have that. That sculpture. For sure. Yeah. yeah. So for my final question, what would something be that would encourage someone to join the dance team if they're on the fence about it? I would say it's just a good way to express yourself and you need to not be so like stressed that you're being judged because everyone is there for one reason and that one reason is because that they love to dance. Yeah. So if it's what you truly love, go out there, express yourself, show your personality and just have a lot of fun with it. Dance team is a lot of fun. We get to go perform at football games, basketball games, shows and all that. And it is a really great experience. For me, for someone who's interested in trying out, definitely has to have experience with technique. We do a lot of ballet, we do a lot of contemporary, we do a lot of jazz, not just hip hop. 
We do it all, so if you have some experience and you do dance at a studio, 100% try out. Um, but yeah, it is a lot of fun. We do a lot of community performances, a lot of football games, a lot of basketball games, and yeah. <laughs> Well, that's all I have for the interview today. Thank you guys so much for being here and being on our yeah, first interview for you. Titan TV. Um, there will definitely be more to come, but thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs>